Hey, y'all, give him some love. This is his debut performance right here. Y'all give him some love. Greg, in the house. Give him some love. Greg, right, thank you. in the house. Thanks a lot. You never know what to play when you do two tunes, right? A song by Sam Cooke. Please feel free to sing along or do the shout back. I'll give you a little trivia when I finish this, too. It's called Bring It Out Home to Me. If you ever change your mind about leaving, leaving me behind, whoa, bring it to me. Bring your sweet loving, bring it on back home to me, yeah, yeah, yeah. You know I laughed, huh? When you left, but I only only heard myself whoa bring it to me bring your sweet loving bring it on back home to me yeah 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 you know i can't change be your slave till i'm buried deep down in my grave whoa bring it to me Bring your sweet loving, bring it on back home to me, yeah, yeah, yeah. Buried deep, deep, deep down in that grave. Whoa, bring it to me. Bring your sweet loving back home to me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. If you ever change your mind about leaving, leaving me behind. Whoa, bring it to me. Bring your sweet loving back home to me, yeah, 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 yeah. Bring it home to me. Thanks a lot. So here's the trivia. Does anyone, I don't know, you remember the original on that? Uh, who did the callbacks? Anybody know? Lou Rawls did the callbacks on that. I got a little trivia there for you. And that, that's been confirmed on the internet, so it must be true. So my name is Greg. I'm in the process of relocating from uh, Boston, Mass. I've got some uh, family issues that I'm out here for. And um, I'd like to thank uh, the uh, Center for the Arts and these guys for letting me go first. You know, you always remember your first time, so. Uh, so uh, I am, uh, if you like what you hear, or even if you don't like what you hear, uh, come and talk to me after. I'm all over the web. Got a lot of original stuff out there on um, <clears throat> iTunes, Amazon, Spotify, all that stuff. Uh, I'm on Facebook. I'll pretend to like you if you'd like. Uh, Reverb Nation. So I wanted to uh, do a song by a guy by the name of Lonnie Mack. Uh, Lonnie Mack uh, was all over the, uh, the South. Uh, and um, he had the misfortune, I guess, of dying the same day Prince did, so most people kind of overlooked it. Not that again, Prince was an important person, but um, <clears throat> Lonnie Mack was a huge influence on uh, uh, Stevie Ray Vaughan. And um, there's a great video of the song of Stevie Ray and Lonnie on YouTube uh, doing this acoustic, which that's unusual for both of them because they're both electric players. But, and I wish I wrote this. If you're an Oreo cookie fan, Please pay attention. This is called Oreo Cookie Blues. Thanks a lot for listening, everybody. Stick around. I got chocolate on my fingers, icing on my lips. I'm getting sugar, diabetes, and flubber on my hips. I keep the night light on in the kitchen, 
so I can go downstairs and cruise. I got the Oreo cream sandwich, chocolate covered, cream filled cookie blues. I got them in a cabinet. They're in a cookie jar. And for emergencies, they're even in the glove compartment of my car. I can't live without them. I just don't want to choose. I got the Oreo cream sandwich, chocolate covered, cream filled cookie blues. The doctor keeps telling me I gotta give them up and quick. Cause if they don't kill me, they'll definitely make me sick. But I can't live without them. They get me higher, higher than booze. I got the Oreo cream sandwich, chocolate covered, cream filled cookie. Made by Nabisco, ain't no rookie. Sometimes they're even better than nookie. Oreo cream sandwich, chocolate covered, cream filled cookie blues. Thanks a lot, everybody. I'm Greg Guba. Please have a great Thanksgiving and be careful out there.